All right, guys, we just got back from a great day of riding and we're ready to load our snowmobiles on the ramp here. A couple things we want to do first before we even load is make sure that our snowmobiles lined up with the trailer. Um, it's, it's pretty important that way so you're not jumping the snowmobile off of the side of the trailer. You just want to make sure that it's lined up perfectly on the ramp. Uh, when you do that, you want to make sure that you have someone helping you. So I'm going to bring in uh, my riding buddy here and we're going to get the ramp unloaded, everything straight, make sure that we're lined up and then we'll load the sleds on the trailer. Now that we have the ramp attached to the trailer, we are ready to load the snowmobile. A couple things, as you'll notice on this ramp, there's some plastic runners. We want to make sure that our skis are right in line with those runners. They're actually a guide to help get us up on the ramp. As you can see here, I'm not touching the ramp yet with my snowmobile. I want to have some space to give me enough area to get up on the ramp. The key here is I want to make sure that I have enough speed, but not too much. I want to make sure that my track barely touches the ramp before I finish the loading of that snowmobile up on the ramp. And you'll see that here as we do that. What you're also going to hear is me feathering the throttle. This isn't a one speed running distance to get up on the ramp. You're going to hear the speed go slower and faster. And again, you're going to notice that here as we load the snowmobile on the trailer. Last thing that you're going to notice is that there is a snowmobile already on the trailer. So we need to make sure that we don't have too much speed to go all the way into that machine. One thing to remember is that this isn't a one and done type of thing. You've got people around you. If you don't get it on the first try, no big deal. Just back it back down again and do it and try it again. Last thing we're going to do is put the ramp in the trailer. We do want to make sure that we put the pin back through the hole so that we secure this ramp inside the trailer so it doesn't come out on your way home. And that's how you do it. All right, the next thing we're going to cover is unloading a snowmobile. First thing we want to do is let this ramp down. To do that, hold the pin out on the other side and then let the ramp down. Uh, the key to unloading a snowmobile is slow is safer and slow is better. As you go up this ramp, you'll notice that there's these metal rungs here. You want to make sure you're stepping on those and not this metal plate here that is not designed to hold your weight. So please be really careful with that. Um, like I mentioned, the snowmobile needs to come down the same angle that this ramp is. So the first thing that we're going to do is uh, climb up here carefully on the ramp. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, start the snowmobile and then I'm going to slowly inch it forward. I'm not riding the snowmobile at this point. I actually want to be just next to the snowmobile so that I can help guide it along. Once I do that, I'm going to occasionally I might move the back end this way or I might have a friend come in and help me pull the ski down the other way. But either way, I want to make sure that the snowmobile goes down the ramp in the same direction that the ramp is pointing. My snowmobile is essentially pointing the same direction as the ramp, so I'm ready to go. I still will have a friend standing next here next to the trailer just in case, but uh, we're ready to unload the snowmobile and get riding. with uh, 
was trailers and snowmobiles and loading and unloading. We are out in the snow and ice and cold. Everything that you're walking around here has the potential to be dangerous. So please be super careful when you're walking on the trailers or the ramps, loading and unloading. Make sure that you use extra precautions to make sure that you ensure your safety and those of the people around you.